jump in! Ready or not, <laughs> here I come! Today, Peppa's family are playing a game of hide and seek. <laughs> Mummy Pig hmm. is the seeker. Aha! Uh -huh. oh. Found you! Oh no! I guess I'll help you find Peppa and George now. <laughs> hmm. Ooh, uh, I just don't know where they could be. Hmm. <laughs> Let's try in the kitchen. <laughs> By that fresh pot of tea. We did it, George. We're the best hiders ever. Peppa and George are looking for a new hiding place. Ooh. Let's hide in the cupboard under the stairs. <laughs> this can be our secret hiding oh. room. <laughs> oh, where could they be, Daddy Pig? I don't think we'll ever find them. <laughs> Mummy and Daddy must be looking for us everywhere. <laughs> we'll just have to keep looking, Mummy Pig. They'll turn up. Biscuit? Peppa and George stay hidden in the secret room for a little while. And then a long while. <laughs> <sighs> and then a really long while. I don't think they'll ever find us. <gasps> so we should get some toys so mm. we don't get bored. Oh, not, not here. here. Not here. Or here. Or here. Keep looking. Or here. Keep looking. Pepper and George are getting lots of toys for their secret room. <laughs> hmm. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh. Uh, where? Are you? Uh-oh. <gasps> <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Ooh. Where did this come from? Daddy Pig, are you okay? <gasps> <laughs> oh! <laughs> well, it's a good job it's your turn to hoover up. <laughs> <laughs> there, much better. <laughs> Where do you think Pepper and George are? Not under the stairs, that's for sure. Pepper and George must be the best hiders in the whole world. Everyone loves playing hide and seek, and Pepper and George really love their secret hiding place. Bye. Daddy Pig has to pick something up from work, so Peppa and George have come with him to his office. Sorry, Mr. Rabbit. Phew. <laughs> George really likes all the buttons in the lift. Oh. 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 oh dear, all that button pushing has broken the lift. Whoopsie, George. Don't worry, George. I'm a bit of an expert at lifts, you know. Ah. Uh, the buttons in the lift aren't working. Hello. Welcome to the lift. <gasps> Is this lift magic? No. It's voice activated, which means we just have to tell it where to go. Much easier. Oh. <clears throat> Hello, lift. We would like to go to my office, please. The lift is working again. Yay! Okay. Floor two. Office of bees. But it hasn't <laughs> taken them to Daddy Pig's office. <laughs> no, not office of bees. Office, please. Floor six. <laughs> office cheese. <laughs> mm, I love cheese. <laughs> I said office. <laughs> Floor 16. A fish. <laughs> Silly magic lift. <laughs> the lift 
doesn't seem to understand Daddy Pig's voice. I'll try. Can we go to Daddy's job? Now arriving at the top. Um. Whoa! <laughs> Not the top. Daddy's job, please. Peppa and her family keep trying to get to Daddy Pig's office. But the magic lift takes them to the wrong floors. Oi! <laughs> and spooky floors. Oh, hello! <laughs> and even party floors. <laughs> but none of them are the right floor until <gasps> my office. <laughs> Hello, Mummy Pig. We just had a little trouble with the lift. Be there soon. <laughs> Pepper and George really love the magic lift. Uh, uh, uh. But Daddy Pig much prefers to take the stairs. <laughs> Today, Pepper and George have come to play in a special bouncy maze. We're in a bit of a rush. So quick as you can, please. Yay! Bye, Bye Mummy! And don't get lost. The first room has a big bouncy castle inside. Nay! Hello! <laughs> Nay! <laughs> Sorry, we can't play. We're in a bit of a rush. Come on, George. Pepper has gone through the blue exit. But George has gone through the red one by mistake. This room has a soft tunnel with Susie's sheep inside. Hi, Susie. Me and George have to go fast because we're in a rush. Oh. <laughs> Bye. Oh, George? This room is extra bouncy. Hi, Rebecca. Is this the way out? We're in a rush. Yes! Through there! Whee! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Hooray! We found the way out! Well done, Pepper! But where's George? Uh, I thought he was behind me. Maybe he's lost in the maze! <gasps> lost? We have to find him! Whee! George isn't lost. He's just having lots of fun. Do you know where George is? No. He went that way. But Mummy Pig is not as good at bouncing as Pepper. We're coming, George. <laughs> it's okay, Mummy. Falling is just as fun as bouncing. We. Um. <gasps> there he is! We're coming, George! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Whee! Whoa. <laughs> Hooray! We found you! Phew! It's time for us to go home! No! George doesn't want to go home. He's having lots of fun in the bouncy maze. <laughs> well. Then we'll have to come and get you. <laughs> Peppa and George love playing in the bouncy maze. We got you. I won't ever lose you again. Look out below. Whee! <laughs> now we really have to go. And so does Mummy Pig. <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are at a fun fair. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. Have you been in the fun house yet? What's a fun house? It's a special fun fair house that has lots of silly rooms and funny hallways. <laughs> Can me and George go into the fun house, please? Please. Hello, Miss Rabbit. Two for the fun house. To enter the fun house, Mummy Pig must buy tokens from Miss um, Rabbit. 
But the tokens cost more coins than Mummy Pig thought. Oh. Thank you, Mummy Pig. Right this way. <laughs> Yay! This is the rickety rackety bridge. Pass through to see the rest of the fun house. <laughs> Peppa is moving very slowly and carefully across the bridge. But George thinks it's fun to go very fast. <laughs> Your way is much better, George. Whee! <laughs> Congratulations! Now you need to follow the arrows. This way, George. <laughs> These mirrors are so wobbly. The funhouse mirrors make Peppa and George look very silly indeed. This mirror makes me look so tall. And you look like you have a very big head, George. <laughs> that one makes you look really round. Round! And this mirror makes me look like Miss Rabbit. That's because I am Miss Rabbit. <gasps> <laughs> Follow me to the twisty, turny tunnel. <laughs> the funhouse tunnel spins round and round. Ooh! Whee! And it's very windy. <laughs> <laughs> look! After the tunnel, we get to go down the slide. Slide! <laughs> I'll help you, George. <laughs> I wonder what's taking so long. I hope they're not lost. <laughs> How was it? The fun house was really fun. How fitting. Everyone <laughs> loves the fun house because the fun house is very today. Peppa is playing with her toy blocks. <gasps> Oop! Careful, George. This is a very small town and you're a very giant dinosaur. That gives me an idea. Do you want to play giants, George? <laughs> George is very excited to play giants with Peppa. <laughs> Hello, Police Officer Panda. What a lovely, quiet, normal day in Toyland. <laughs> and definitely no sign of... <gasps> Hello, I am Giant Pepper. <gasps> a giant! Two giants! <laughs> Pepper and George are imagining their giants in a pretend <laughs> toy block world. Hello, birds. Hello, clouds. <laughs> <gasps> Hello, everyone. <gasps> Bear, our ball is stuck in that very tall tree. We can help you with that. We are very tall giants. <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> Oh, careful, George. <laughs> there you go, Susie. Hooray! <laughs> giant Pepper and Giant George love to help their friends in Toyland. <gasps> they help the passengers wee! to get on the bus. Oh, wee! <laughs> wee! Wee! <laughs> and help the boats go very, very fast. <laughs> Stop! <gasps> it's the bridge you broke earlier. Oh! Don't worry, we can fix it. <laughs> Peppa and George are experts with toy blocks. They fix the toy bridge in no time at all. Thanks, Giant Peppa and Giant George. Stop! Uh, I mean, go! Hooray! Hooray! Too. The food in Toyland is too small for Giant Pepper and Giant George. Whoa! Dinner time! Hooray! 
Maybe so. They will have to have real food instead. Careful, George. <laughs> Peppa and Rebecca Rabbit are making a pillow fort today. Careful, don't fall on the fort. Almost got it. Whoa. Squeak. We did it. Now we need to decorate the inside. Uh, hmm, something else is missing. Oh, oh something, something to eat! eat. <laughs> <laughs> Mummy! What a beautiful pillow fort! Can we have something to eat, please? Of course, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Let's pretend the pillow fort is really big inside. <coughs> wow! <laughs> Catch, Peppa! <laughs> Let's pretend the floor is really bouncy, like a trampoline. Squeak! <laughs> it's so bouncy! <laughs> bounced over there. Let's bounce after it. Uh, uh. This floor is green, so let's pretend it's squelchy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the ball isn't here. Maybe over there. <laughs> <laughs> this room is blue, so let's pretend it's cold. <laughs> There's the ball. Hooray! L let's get out of here. Um, which way did we c come in? Peppa, where are you? We're lost in the pillow fort. I'll come get you. No, Mummy. The fort isn't built for grown-ups. Oh, I can fit through anything. Uh, oh, uh. Mummy Pig is stuck. Oh. Uh, uh. Mummy, your wiggles are breaking the fall. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> For you. Oh. All that pretending has made me even more hungry. Good thing I brought you some food. Now, we just need to find it under these pillows. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! The treasure train is on its way. Choo choo! <laughs> Yay! Peppa Pig and Danny Dog are driving a train full of gold, silver, and broccoli! <laughs> Broccoli treasure? Yes, it's special broccoli made of sparkly diamonds. Peppa and Danny aren't really driving a train. They're using their imagination to pretend. Hooray! Stop! <gasps> In the name of... um... robbers! <gasps> oh no! Pedro Pony and Susie Sheep are pretending to be train robbers. Can we have all your treasure, please? <laughs> no. Oh, OK. <laughs> You're supposed to steal the treasure, <laughs> Susie. <laughs> oh! Ha-ha! <laughs> we have stolen all the treasure! Hooray! <sighs> Um, what do we do now? You escape. Oh, yes. Yeehaw! Whoa! <laughs> Come back, you naughty robbers. Now Peppa and Danny are pretending to be police officers. They're going to catch the robbers. Oh. You caught us. No, we didn't. Because, um... Ha! Your boat can fly! Whoa. Um, 
Madam Gazelle, can ships fly? Real ships cannot fly. Oh. But pretend ships certainly can. Hooray! Wow! Now Pedro and Susie are in a flying boat. Oh, um... <gasps> Our train can fly too. Whee! Police officers Pepper and Danny have almost caught the robbers. Home <gasps> time! Oh. <gasps> Is it a giant? No, it's a daddy pig. And he's coming to take you home. <laughs> Charge! <Yeah. laughs> what are you doing, Pepper? We're pretending to fly our boats and trains, Daddy. <laughs> oh, my! What an imaginative bunch you all are. Oh, aha! Uh -huh. Pepper loves imagining things. Everyone loves imagining things. Today, Mummy Pig has brought Pepper and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello, I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! Oh! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy. Ooh! Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot, or a princess, or a silly monster, or a... <gasps> dinosaur! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Dinosaur! 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 <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his favourite. I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> Lovely. A spaceman. A monster. A superhero. Peppa and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot. Dinosaur! Fantastic! Now with a little toy shop magic... <laughs> the machine will make your toys! Lovely! <laughs> now, you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> there are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! <gasps> perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh, yes. Ah, oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. Flight <laughs> <laughs> egg is fun. Whee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa. Whee! Wow, what is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still! What was that? <gasps> Ta-da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just <laughs> like Pepper. Look, George, I'm tiny! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> <gasps> and so are you! <laughs> Pepper and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. Today, Peppa and Mummy Pig are riding the bumper cars yeah. at Potato City. Can't catch me, Rebecca! <laughs> oh, yes, I can! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Peppa! We found a new ride! It's a water ride! <laughs> it's so splashy! I love splashy rides! Splashy? Mummy Pig isn't sure she loves splashy rides. Uh, why don't we go on a ride without splashes? Like, uh, oh, this bench! Ooh, what fun! Whee! <laughs> we can go on that after. 
Come on, Mummy! Yay! <laughs> Everyone has arrived at the new water ride. Celery Stick Falls. Uh-oh! Stop! <laughs> oh, it is very splashy. Very, very splashy. <laughs> <laughs> Adults in the front, please. That means you, Mummy Pig, right here. Oh, right. Um, okay. Enjoy the ride. <laughs> oh. oh, this is quite lovely. The ride is going very high up. Everyone loves to splash. Yoo hoo! <laughs> Would you like a small splash, a big splash, or a humongous splash? Um, a humongous splash, please. Yeah. Yeah. Okie dokie. Ready? Yes. No. Five against one. <gasps> Off you go. The celery stick falls are very fast and very splashy. There we are. Nice and dry. No, oh, not again. Yay! <laughs> Yay! That was amazing! <laughs> and very, very splashy! <laughs> Mummy, what are you doing? The splashes were... Amazing! Let's go again! Now Mummy Pig loves humongous splashes. Everyone loves humongous splashes. Today, Peppa and her family have been at the supermarket. Outside the supermarket is a toy machine. Yay! Ooh! Mandy Mouse has got a toy. Well done, Mandy. Peppa, George, would you like a go on the toy machine? Yes, please. How does it work, Miss Rabbit? You just buy a token and put it in the slot. Then a ball rolls all the way down to the bottom of the machine and there's a <laughs> special surprise toy inside. Dinosaur! George would like to get a dinosaur toy. How fun! You can have one try each. Here you go. Yay! <laughs> Yay! George's token makes the machine light up and play music. A ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. Whoa! Dinosaur! George has got a toy screwdriver. A screwdriver! How useful! Dinosaur. Don't worry, George. I'll try to get the dinosaur too. Now, Peppa's token <laughs> makes the machine light up and a different ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> oh. Peppa hasn't got the dinosaur, but she has got some very nice stickers. Dinosaur! What lovely toys you got. <gasps> but look, our ice cream is starting to melt. So close. I have a feeling the dinosaur will come out next time. <laughs> Please, can we have one more go, Mummy? Please! <laughs> oh, go on then. <laughs> one more try. Hooray! <laughs> Pepper and George pull the lever on the toy machine. But this time, no balls pop out. Oh! <laughs> Oh dear, I wanted to see what toy you were going to get. Not to <gasps> worry, Mummy Pig. I can fix it. I just need to find my screwdriver. Nope. Nope. <gasps> screwdriver. Ah, thank you, George. <gasps> <gasps> Yay! <gasps> Whoops. <laughs> Miss Rabbit has fixed the machine too much. Now all the balls have fallen out. I'd better put these back, 
but I think you earned this for helping me fix the machine. <gasps> Dinosaur! <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This is for you. Eh? <gasps> <laughs> Everyone loves the toy machine, and George really loves dinosaurs. Huh. Uh. 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 Wow. wow! Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the arcade. You got a high score. That's because Peppa and I are experts at all of these games. Look at all these tokens, Peppa. If you collect lots of these, you can trade them in for a huge prize. Wow, a prize? Squeak! Look at all these tokens. <laughs> can we play that game next? Of course, Peppa. Mummy Pig is showing Peppa how to play Carrot Bop. She is bopping the carrots whenever they pop up. Bop! 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 <laughs> Would you both like to have a go? Yes, please! Bop! 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 <laughs> More token! Does this mean we can get a really big... Prize, Daddy. Daddy? <laughs> Daddy Pig is playing the dancing game. Daddy Pig loves dancing. Wow. I'm a bit of an expert at dancing, you know. Your turn, Pepper. <laughs> 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 Wow! Yay! <laughs> Phew, that was fun. But is there a game we can play all together? I know just the game. <laughs> Peppa and her family are playing a balloon game. Whoever fills their balloon with water first wins. another high score? Yes! Your score was so high that you have all won the jackpot. Now you can trade in all your tokens for a huge prize. Hooray! Let's go! Hello again, Peppa. Here are all our tokens. Can we please have our prize? Of course! With this many tokens, you can get a marvellous, extraordinary, one-of-a-kind pencil. Hooray! A pencil! Peppa loves winning lots of tokens with her family at the arcade. And Peppa really loves her brand new pencil. Today, Peppa and George are helping Daddy Pig tidy some old boxes. <laughs> What's this, Daddy? Ah, that's my trusty old camera, Pepper. You press the button to take a picture. Cheese. And it prints the photo out. Look, I can see it. Can I have a go, please? <laughs> Say cheese. Cheese. Now Pepper is taking photos with the camera. This <laughs> camera is really fun. <laughs> Have fun! But there isn't much photo paper left, so use it wisely. George loves taking lots of photos. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear, it's run out of photo paper. Oh, but I love taking pictures. Hmm. Why don't we use my phone's camera instead? It can even add filters to a photo. <laughs> Daddy Pig's phone camera has given George a pretend moustache. <laughs> Come on, George. Let's take more photos. Peppa and George are having lots of fun taking pictures. The phone camera has given Mummy Pig a flowery filter. Say cheese. Oh.
And Grandpa Pig has a very fine hat. <laughs> Pepper, George and Daddy Pig have come to the park to take even more photos. <laughs> Hello, Mr and Mrs Bird. Cheese! <laughs> what a funny photo! Daddy Pig wants to take a photo with Pepper and George <laughs> by the ducks. Say cheese, everybody! One, two, three, cheese! <laughs> Pepper and George are sticking all the photos from the day into a scrapbook. Look at this one, George. But some of the photos are blurry. Oh. The photos don't have to be perfect. They just have to remind you of a lovely day. Everyone loves taking photos. And everyone has had a very lovely day. A super strike for a super bowler. Today, Susie Sheep is having a bowling party. <laughs> to get a super strike too. I know how to do it. I've been bowling lots of times. Then you can show everyone what to do, Peppa. OK. We should take our pictures for the scoreboard. <laughs> Just step in front of the camera and say cheese. Cheese! Perfect. This is your bowling lane. Ooh. Now you treat the bowling ball. Then you throw it straight ahead. Like this. Yay! <laughs> I'm going to try. I like this one. The pink ball is very heavy. <laughs> try this one instead. It's lighter. Whoa. Crikey! Anyone lost a ball? Oh, no. I'll try next. Oh. Pedro Pony's ball has gone into the gutter at the side of the lane. Whoops! My turn. Whoa! <laughs> Susie Sheep, Pedro Pony and Gerald Giraffe haven't quite got the hang of bowling yet. Don't worry. We need to find a better way to play. Hmm. Why don't you try with the barriers up this time? It's another fun way to play. Now you try, Pedro. OK, but I don't want my bowling ball to bounce. No problem. You can use a ramp to help the ball roll in a straight line. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Peppa and her friends are having lots of fun bowling in their own ways. <laughs> but Susie Sheep still wants to get a super strike. All right, everyone. It's your last bowl. Good luck. <laughs> Watch this. Susie Sheep is bowling backwards. Oh. <gasps> a super strike for a super bowler! Susie Sheep has got a super strike. Susie Sheep loves bowling. Everyone loves bowling. <laughs> oh, sorry Mummy Pig. I've got to close early today. I've got the sniffles. Oh. I was really looking forward to my spa day. Why don't we make a spa at home? Oh, that's a great idea, Peppa. Peppa is very good at having ideas. Hello, Mrs Mummy. Welcome to the spa. Oh. <laughs> Peppa has turned the living room into a very <laughs> special spa. First, we are going to... 
Um, what happens at the spa, Mummy? Well, we normally start with a nice cup of lemon water. I can do that. I'll get you some lemony water, <laughs> Mrs Mummy. Here you go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Mmm. Thank you, Pepper. This is the lemoniest water I've ever seen. What's next? Next, I'd like to have a foot bath. Yay! Hey! What's a foot bath? It's a very small bath just for your feet. OK, <laughs> time for your very small bath just for your feet, Mrs Mummy. Come on, Daddy. <laughs> Pepper and Daddy Pig are making their very own foot bath. This ought to do the trick. <laughs> ah, that's so relaxing. <gasps> Pepper has turned the foot bath into a regular bath. <laughs> Here are the boats you ordered, Miss Pepper. <laughs> you have to have bubbles and toys in the bath. <laughs> Wonderful! I'll suggest this to Miss Rabbit. What's next, Mummy? Next, it's time for a massage. Uh, um... Here, lie down on the sofa and I'll show you how it works. Peppa finds the massage very tickly. Your turn, Mummy. Ooh, <laughs> it's <laughs> very different to my normal massage. It's a special pepper <laughs> massage. <laughs> Choo -choo. Now, the last thing I do at the spa is have a mud mask, which is... A mask made of mud. Yes, a special spa mud that's good for your skin. I don't think we have any special spa mud here, though. <sighs> I've got an idea. Pepper is very, <laughs> very good at having ideas. We don't need spa mud when we've got muddy puddles! <laughs> <laughs> They're just like muddy puddle face masks. <laughs> Pepper loves a spa day, especially when it involves jumping in muddy puddles. Gosh, what a frightfully loud horn! Today, <laughs> Pepper and her family are on a cruise ship. Hello, everyone. Welcome aboard. Are you ready for the safety tour? First mate Miss Rabbit has come to show them all the things that make the ship safe. I can't wait. I know a thing or two about boats, you know. I think I might have a tour of those sun lounges. Have fun. This way, everyone. Bye. <laughs> This big boat has lots of small boats hanging off the side. Ah. These are the lifeboats. If the ship stops working, we put on our life jackets and hop inside. Here's your life jacket, Pepper. <laughs> oh. oh, well, here's yours, Grandpa Pig. Vroom, vroom, vroom. <laughs> No running on the deck, please. The floor on a boat oh. is called the deck. <laughs> Sorry. That's OK. On with the tour. Follow me <laughs> up the stairs. Aye, aye, Miss Rabbit. Aye, aye, Miss Rabbit. These look like big spinning spoons. They are the satellites. They tell the ah. ship which way to go. Are these giant mirrors, Miss Rabbit? Oh, 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 no, Pepper. These are... Well, they're... Um, what are they, Miss Rabbit? These are the solar panels. Our ship is powered by energy from the sun. Of course. Jolly good job, son. <laughs> One more stop on the tour to go. Time to head back down. <gasps> what a good idea, George. Hop in, everyone. Whee! <laughs> Ooh. This wow. is the bridge. Wow. <laughs> this isn't a bridge, it's a room. The place where the captain drives a big ship like this is called the bridge. Oh, what do all these buttons do? I can answer that. I know a thing Ooh. or two about boats, <laughs> you know. <clears throat> This button turns the lights on. Whoops! 
<laughs> um, and this lever makes us speed up. Oh. Whoa. Perhaps I ought to stop. Good idea. What does this button do? That's the foghorn. It makes a very loud noise that tells other boats we're nearby. Do you want to give it a push? Yes, please. Gosh! Oh! <laughs> what a frightfully loud horn! <laughs> Sorry, Granny. <laughs> Peppa loves exploring the cruise ship, but she loves the foghorn most of all. <laughs> Hi. Today, Peppa is going to Rebecca Rabbit's boat. Bye. <clears throat> Today, Peppa is already at Rebecca Rabbit's burrow. She's come to play a new Whoa. video game called... Carrot Catcher! Do you want to play? <gasps> yes, please. I'm amazingly really excellent at games. Oh, dear. Peppa doesn't know how to begin the game. Um, I am amazingly really excellent at games. But maybe it would be more fun if you started the game, Rebecca. <laughs> oh, yes. I knew that. <laughs> First, you pick your bunny. Then you hop around and catch the carrots. Oh, yes. Um... Uh, uh, Peppa uh, is amazingly really excellent at video games, but she might need a bit of help with this one. Uh, how do you catch the carrots, please, Rebecca? Like this! <gasps> Yay! I'm good at this. <laughs> oh. My turn! <laughs> Wow! Rebecca Rabbit is amazingly really excellent at this game. Wow! You're really good at catching carrots, Rebecca. <laughs> I've had lots of practice. Do you want to play together now? We can be a team. <gasps> yes! Woohoo! <laughs> Got it! Yay! Here's one! There's one! Whee! <laughs> New high score! Hooray! Peppa and Rebecca make a very good team. Rosie! Robbie! What are you doing? <laughs> Hello, you two! Have you seen the twins? They've run off with our lunch! <gasps> we'll catch them! We're good at catching carrots! And baby bunnies! <laughs> <laughs> Found one! Rosie! <laughs> gotcha! Here's another one! Robbie! Got it! Mm, still good! Peppa and Rebecca are very good carrot catchers. Yay! Hooray! Lunch is safe! <laughs> See you! In fact, Peppa and Rebecca are amazingly really excellent carrot catchers. Today, Peppa and her friends have come to a special adventure park. Come on, Edmund, you can do it. It's really fun. Well done, Edmund. <gasps> this room has a balance beam. You have to walk across <laughs> it without falling into the ball pit. If you all keep working as a team, you'll get all the way through without falling into the ball pits. I'm good at balancing. Follow me. Now, George, Pepper, and Edmund Elephant must cross the balance beam. But Edmund is finding the balance beam a bit difficult. Try going sideways, Edmund. We can do it together. Hooray! Everyone has made it across the balance beam. Now they must swing across this room. This looks tricky. 
It's just like the swing in the park, Emily. Watch this. Whee! Peppa is very good at swinging. Hooray! Hold on tight, George. <laughs> Here you go, Edmund. But Edmund Elephant is feeling a little nervous about it. Why don't we go together, Edmund, as a team? Good idea! Whee! Hooray! We did it! Thank you, Emily. Everyone has made it across the big swing. Good teamwork, everyone. One room to go. <laughs> this is the final Whoa. room, but there is no way across the ball pit. We can't jump that far. And there's nothing to swing on. Ho, ho, ho. This room is a bit of a puzzle. <gasps> Nobody knows how to solve the puzzle and get across. Oh. I've got it. But Edmund Elephant is very <gasps> good at puzzles. <laughs> I'm a clever clogs, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone has made it through the adventure park. That was very clever, Edmund. Edmund? And Edmund Elephant can't wait to do it all over again. Today, Peppa and her classmates are visiting a chocolate factory. Can I try some chocolate, please, Miss Rabbit? You can, Peppa. But we've got to make it first. Oh. <laughs> Peppa is very excited to make chocolate. How do we make it, Miss Rabbit? With this machine. Hello, machine. Can you make me some chocolate, please? <gasps> Thank you, machine. Yay! Now can I try some of it, please? Not yet, Peppa. We need to decorate it first. Follow me! Hooray! Everyone is very excited to decorate the chocolate too. You can decorate one chocolate bar each. Ooh, it looks like a muddy puzzle. <laughs> yes, but don't jump in it, Peppa. And you can add whatever decorations you like from the table as long as it's yummy. Mine is a carroty chocolate bar. <laughs> Delicious! Mine is a cheesy chocolate bar. Squeak! Yum, yum! And mine is a spaghetti chocolate bar. Oh. Because strawberry laces look like spaghetti. <laughs> Phew! Scrumptious! Can I try some chocolate now, please, Miss Rabbit? Almost, Peppa. The chocolate needs to cool in the fridge first. The fridge is very cold and makes the liquid chocolate oh. harden into bars. And done. Yay! <laughs> oh. Can we please try some chocolate now, Miss Rabbit? Not yet, Pep. Oh, wait. Yes, you can. <gasps> <Hooray>! <laughs> Hmm. Is something wrong, Peppa? No. I just really liked it when the chocolate was all runny like a muddy puddle. Ho oh, oh. ho! Then it's lucky I have one more treat for you Yay! all. It's a chocolate fountain! It's just like a giant chocolate muddy puddle. And lots of nice, healthy fruit to dip to. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. Peppa loves muddy puddles, especially when they're made out of chocolate. <laughs> Today, Peppa and Susie are playing in the treehouse. Oh, hello, Susie. Do come along in. How awfully, terribly kind. They're pretending to be grown-ups. We should have a big, delicious cuppa. Gosh, we are having lots of weather, aren't we? 
<gasps> Someone is at the door. Sorry to interrupt. Your oh. mummy is here to take you home, Susie. Aww. But we were going to have a tea party like grown-ups. Can we have a sleepover in the treehouse, Grandpa? Please? Oh, um... Of course <laughs> you can. You and Susie can sleep in the treehouse and Grandpa Pig and I will camp out here to look after you. Hooray! <laughs> Peppa and Susie are Yay! very excited to have a sleepover in the treehouse. Here are your sleeping bags, oh. <laughs> pillows, <laughs> lots of cuddly toys, <laughs> <laughs> and the best bit? A special starry lantern. Wow! wow. Ta-da! <laughs> All finished. Oh. Huh. Suppose I don't need these. Grandpa Pig is excited to sleep in the tent, Whoa. too. Whoa! Ah, or perhaps I do. Once he uh. has rebuilt it. <laughs> <laughs> it is bedtime now. So Granny and hmm. Grandpa Pig are going to their tent. Good night, you two. We're just here if you need us. <laughs> <gasps> Look, Susie. My shadow's really big. Ooh. <laughs> mine is a bird. Tweet, tweet. And mine is a butterfly. <laughs> Everything okay? There was a really loud noise. Gosh! Hmm. Hmm. Ah! Oh, my goodness! Is it a monster? Oh. Hmm? Oh. oh. <laughs> no monsters here. Just Grandpa <gasps> Pig snoring. Peppa and Susie love sleeping oh. in the treehouse. What's, what's all this then? Oh, dear. <laughs> Even with Grandpa Pig snoring next door. <laughs> are volcanoes real, Madam Gazelle? They are. Ooh. But do not worry, children. There are no volcanoes close by. Hooray! Except the little pretend ones that we are going to make for today's very special science experiment. Oh. We will make our volcanoes using glue and newspaper. Like this. First, you dip the paper in the glue, and then you stick it all to the beaker. And voila! A volcano! Everyone is enjoying making their volcanoes. The glue is very sticky and messy. <laughs> and soon they are all finished. <laughs> Wonderful, children! Now it is time to paint your creations. <laughs> Let's make ours red, Peppa. Ours can be blue! blue. Green, like a big tree. Real volcanoes are dark and grey with red lava. But Peppa and her friends are making their mini volcanoes bright and colourful. <laughs> now it is time for the science experiment. But first, everyone must put on special gloves, glasses and coats to make sure they are safe. You all look like wonderful scientists, children. Now we are ready to make lava. <gasps> but do not worry. The lava we are making is just pretend and very safe. <laughs> First, we add some vinegar to our volcanoes. Be careful not to spill. Uh, uh, <gasps> Perfect. And now I will add a secret magic ingredient to each of your volcanoes. Nobody knows what the special magic ingredient is. Finally, take your cup of baking soda and pour a little inside the volcano. 
Then stand back. Madame Gazelle's volcano is erupting, just like a real volcano. Your turn, children. Hooray! <laughs> wow! The lava is red. Ours is blue. Candy Cat and Gerald Giraffe's lava is green and very foamy. I think we made too much lava. No, Candy, you made a muddy puddle. Everyone loves making volcanoes, but everyone really loves making colourful muddy puddles. Today, Peppa and her friends are going to the sweet shop. Hello, Miss Rabbit. I'd like to buy everything in the sweet shop, please. Here is my coin. Peppa and her friends each have one coin to buy a sweet with. Here is my coin too. And mine. And mine. Wow, what a lot of money. But I'm afraid it's not enough to buy everything in the shop. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> One coin is perfect for trying my new sweet making machines though. Ooh. Just choose a machine, pop your coin in the slot and push the big red button. Mmm, strawberry laces! Nay! But strawberries are fruits, not sweets! My sweets are made with delicious real fruit. Much tastier and much healthier. Yummy strawberries! They look like hair! <laughs> You're right! I've got a strawberry ponytail! <laughs> <laughs> my turn! My turn! Emily Elephant has found a rainbow lollipop machine. For this machine, you have to push the buttons to choose your favourite fruity flavours. Hmm... Yellow banana! Ooh, you love red apples! <laughs> And pink raspberries! And blue blueberries! And green apples! <laughs> <laughs> you like all the flavours! <laughs> so fruity! <laughs> Look! It's a beginning ball! <laughs> That's a candy floss machine! Why don't you pop your coin in and give it a go? Mm, it tastes like coconut! <laughs> it looks just like you, Susie! And now it looks even more like you! <laughs> <gasps> what is that? Only one way to find out! But I thought this was a sweetie machine, not a money machine. <gasps> Can I use this to buy some real sweeties? You don't need to. That coin is a sweetie pepper. It's a chocolate coin. Chocolate! Hooray! Pepper loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Everyone loves a sweet treat from the sweet shop. Today is Ooh. pancake day. So Peppa and her family are eating at a fancy pancake restaurant. Hello, I'll be your chef today. I make the pancakes right at your table and you get to help. What kind of pancakes can we make? Any you can think of. We have lots of yummy ingredients. I'll have the special mushroom pancake, please. One banana-licious banana pancake with extra bananas for me, please. Coming right up. Miss Rabbit is good at making pancakes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Now a little colour. Then add the mushrooms. Bananas and extra bananas. Ooh! And now for the best bit. <laughs> Smelling. Eating. <laughs> Flipping it. Exactly. Woohoo!
this rabbit is very good at making pancakes. <laughs> Yay! Mmm! Phew! Now, what would you two like in your pancakes? I would like a chocolatey chocolate pancake. With chocolate, please. <laughs> you clearly have a sweet tooth. And you, George? <laughs> oh! Peas and tomato for George. And pineapple, coconut, cabbage. Hmm. And this. No, that's oh. red hot chilli. Peppa. <laughs> Peppa and George like all kinds of ingredients on their pancakes and lots of them. Ta-da! Yay! Want to help me flip? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> now, on the count of three, we'll give them a gentle little flip. One, two... Flip! <laughs> Peppa and George have flipped their pancakes Whoa. very high and onto <laughs> Mr. Bull's plate. Oh, yummy! Mmm, tore very much. Mmm, it's sweet mm. and savoury, crunchy and ooh, spicy. Oh, ooh, delicious! Oh, wow. <laughs> It's a special surprise pancake. Oh, mm. pancake? <laughs> Peppa and George love making super special surprise pancakes. Looks like we'll have to make another for you two. Yay! Yay! <laughs> but they really love eating them when they're done. Yummy, tasty food. Yummy, tasty Today on the cruise, yummy. Peppa and her family are at a very Yay! special ah. type of restaurant. This is a special type of restaurant called a buffet. Just take a plate and choose the food you want to eat. Enjoy! Oh, oh goody! The restaurant mm. buffet has lots of different foods to choose from. What would you like to eat, Peppa? Spaghetti is my favourite. Right you are. But we mustn't take too much. We can always come back and get some more. Oh, good idea. <laughs> and what would you like, George? Juice! Thirsty, are you? <laughs> I think we can rustle up some orange juice. <laughs> Let's see here. Aha! Ooh. The orange juice machine is very loud. And it hasn't made very much orange juice at all. Oh. Juice! We'll just have to make some more. <laughs> Delicious! I can't wait to... Finished! Oh. Mm. <laughs> you were hungry, Pepper. Can I get some more now, please? Oh. Of course. Let's go. Hooray! Grandpa Pig is still trying to make George a cup of orange juice. Oh, dear. Could we have some more oranges, please, Miss Rabbit? Right away. Ooh. Pepper has found a very special pancake machine. Just one pancake, please, Mr. Robot. I can always come back and get more. Mm -hmm. Splendid! Aha! Granny Pig is ah. very excited ah. to eat her spaghetti. Ah! Finished! Oh. Thank you, Pancake Robot. But now, Peppa is thirsty mm. too. Can I get some juice as well, Granny? Of course. Grandpa Pig can get you some. I do wonder what's ah. taking him so long. Mm. <gasps> Grandpa Pig has finally made a cup of orange juice. In fact, Grandpa Pig has made lots of cups of orange juice. Oh. The machine has finally stopped oh. making oh. orange juice. Phew. Silly Grandpa. You don't need to make all the juice. You can always come back and get more. Peppa loves the buffet restaurant. Mm. And George really <laughs> loves orange juice. Today, 
Mummy and Peppa have brought George to the doctors for a checkup. Hello, I'm Dr. Peppa Pig. <laughs> Hello, Dr. Peppa Pig. I'm Nurse Miss Rabbit. <laughs> and this is Dr. Brown Bear. Ready for your checkup, George? No! George <gasps> has never been to the doctors before. He is a little nervous. Don't worry, George. The doctors just want to make sure you feel good. Exactly. Come on in and don't forget your little red book. <laughs> First, Miss Rabbit and Dr Brown Bear need to check George's height. <gasps> Step this way, please, George. No! But George isn't sure he'll like the height measurer. <laughs> How tall am I, Miss Rabbit? Wow! You're getting very tall, Peppa. You'll be a big grown-up soon. <laughs> George wants to know if he is very tall too. Wow! You're so big and tall, George. <laughs> now it's time to check George's weight with a special machine called scales. This machine will tell us how much you weigh, George. And it's really good <laughs> for bouncing. <laughs> George loves bouncing. <laughs> and freeze. <gasps> mm -hmm. And unfreeze. <laughs> <laughs> now it's time to listen to George's heart with a special tool called a oh. stethoscope. Oh. This might be a little cold. <laughs> the stethoscope is very cold. Oh. Try this, George. You can listen to my heartbeat too. George likes listening to Peppa's heart. <laughs> Yay! You did very well today, George. So you get a sticker. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> oh. Daddy, sure. <laughs> and one for Dr. Peppa Pig for being so helpful too. Hooray! <laughs> Four tickets, please. Four popcorns, please. Four drinks, please. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at the cinema. Peppa's favourite book has been made into a movie. <laughs> Silly George, we're not seeing that scary ghost movie. Ours is really fun and not scary. Scary ghost <laughs> movies are only for grown-ups. Uh, oh, excuse me. Excuse Sorry. me. Uh, oh. Sorry. <sighs> <sighs> the seats in the cinema all fold up when they're not being used. But George's seat is folding up when he's sitting in it. Excuse me, coming through. Watch your toes. Luckily, Miss Rabbit has a special booster to hold the seat flat. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. No problem. Me again. <gasps> Who spilled popcorn? <laughs> <laughs> George doesn't like it when the cinema gets dark. Whoosh, whoosh. Yay, it's starting! <gasps> Sorry! <laughs> George doesn't like the loud sounds either. Oh dear, 
George thinks the baddie in the movie is a bit scary. Maybe we should take George outside. But you can't miss the movie. Oh! Pepper has thought of a way to make the baddie less scary for George. Hello, George. It's me. I'm just pretending to be a buddy for the movie. I'm not really scary. Not scary? No. And this magic wand oh. will keep you extra safe. Wish! <laughs> Wish! <laughs> Plus, at the end of the story, everyone lives happily ever after. Ooh! Happy! <laughs> Wish! Shh! <gasps> Sorry! Everyone <laughs> loves going to the cinema, and George really loves movies with happy endings. Oh dear. <laughs> there, there. Today, Peppa has found a video <gasps> of when she was a baby. <laughs> I was a very loud baby, wasn't I, Daddy? Ho, oh, oh, ho, yes. All babies are sometimes. Gosh, oh. that must have been when I was pregnant with George. Pregnant? What does that mean? <laughs> that means he was still in my tummy. <laughs> oh, I have an idea. <laughs> what are you doing, Peppa? Look, now there's a baby in my tummy too. Oh, <laughs> very good, Peppa. Now, what do people with babies in their tummies do? Hmm, I used to get lots of funny cravings, which are when you really want to eat certain foods. Ooh. Ooh. Yum! Peppa has decided she has a craving too. I really want to eat... Oh! Spaghetti! <laughs> Peppa thinks cravings are delicious. <laughs> <laughs> ah! That was very yummy. <laughs> what else happens when you have a baby in your tummy, Mummy? Well, I'd get tired a lot. So kind people would offer me their seat so I could sit down when I needed it. Hmm. <clears throat> Hello, Pepper. I have a baby on my tummy and I'm very tired. So you need to give me your chair, please, Daddy. <laughs> Gosh. Righto, here you go. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> and sometimes my feet would hurt. So Daddy Pig would give me foot rubs. <gasps> Peppa likes the sound of foot rubs. Daddy, my feet are hurting. So I need to have a foot rub, please. Oh, well, not a moment to lose. <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> a little here and a little Daddy Pig's foot rubs are more Mr. like foot tickles. <laughs> oh. There's one more thing that happened when Mummy Pig was pregnant. What was it? Eventually, Ooh. a baby came. Auntie Pig has brought Baby Alexander for a visit. Hi, Baby Alexander. I was pretending I had a baby oh. in my tummy. But now we can pretend that you're my baby. <laughs> Real babies are quite noisy, actually. So I think I'll keep my cushion instead. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> Today, Peppa and George are playing grown-ups. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Where is my bag and my hat? We're off to work now, Mummy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and what job do you think you'd enjoy when you're grown up? Dinosaur! <gasps> George wants to be a dinosaur. Hmm, I think I would enjoy being a dentist. Then I will make sure everyone's teeth are nice and healthy. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> Oh, oh, hang all right. You've got lots of clean teeth, Mummy. Oh. Here's a sticker for being so brave. Don't forget to brush your teeth. 
Who's next? <laughs> Silly George. Dinosaurs don't go to the dentist. <laughs> they go to Dr Hamster the vet. <laughs> but you can have a sticker anyway. I think you'd make a very good dentist. <laughs> and you'd be an excellent dinosaur, George. But I'd also like to be a bus driver. Then I could take all my friends to the park. Tickets, please. Next stop, <laughs> the park. Stop! <gasps> you forgot <gasps> us. Come back. <laughs> <laughs> you have to stop at all the bus stops if you want to be a bus driver, Peppa. Oops, <gasps> sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I think you'd be a brilliant bus driver, Peppa. But I don't just want to be a dentist and a bus driver. I also want to be a teacher. Oh. <laughs> then I'll teach everybody how to paint. You can paint a butterfly using handprints like this. <gasps> Dinosaurs don't go to school, George. Perhaps you could open a school for dinosaurs. But when I'm grown up, I also want to jump in muddy puddles. <laughs> <laughs> and George will be a dinosaur. And they will always love jumping in muddy puddles, even when they are grown up or dinosaurs. Welcome oh. to the ice cream shop. It is a very hot day, so Peppa and George are playing ice cream shop. Here you go, Mr Daddy Pig. Oh, thank you. What would you like, Mrs Mummy Pig? I'd like a banana split, please. Hooray! Oh. Ooh! What's a banana split, Granny? <laughs> it's a type of dessert. First, we need to cut a banana in half. Nana! Oh! Ho, 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 ho! Now, we add ice cream, cherries and whipped cream. Ah. George <laughs> likes adding the ice cream. Careful! Don't squish the banana. <laughs> And Peppa really likes adding whipped cream. <laughs> Don't forget the cherry on top. Here is your banana split, Mrs. Mummy Pig. <laughs> this looks delicious. Oh, please could I have... A Knickerbocker Glory. Uh -huh. A Knockanori? What's that, madam? Ho, ho, ho. Uh -huh. It's a type of ice cream sundae. Can you only eat them on Sundays? Oh. Ho, ho. Not that type of sundae. You can eat them any time. Uh -huh. I'll show you. Uh -huh. We need ice cream, fruit, meringue and cream. <laughs> Peppa and George add all the ingredients into the glass. Oh. And now you can decorate the top. Yay! Then decorate with wafers, colourful sprinkles and sauce. Here you are, ah, madam. This looks wonderful. <laughs> now everyone has been served, what kind of ice cream would you two like? Hmm. A rainbow ah, one! Rainbow! Peppa and George use lots of different <laughs> coloured ice cream. Pink for strawberry, brown for chocolate, yellow for <laughs> banana... Nana! Then they add their toppings. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's mix it all together! Um... <laughs> <laughs> oh. Peppa and George have mixed all the colours together. We've made a muddy puddle, ah. not rainbow ice cream. 
I'm afraid we don't have much ice cream left. All we have is vanilla. My favorite. <laughs> Peppa and George like making special ice creams, but they love vanilla ice cream the most. Pretty cool, eh, Peppa? <laughs> Daddy, we're getting shoes for George, not you. Oh, yes. Today, George is <laughs> buying some new shoes. Hello, Miss Rabbit. We need some new shoes for George. <laughs> George's shoes are very old. Well, you're in luck. The shoe shop has oh. lots of shoes. We'll find George the perfect pair. Hooray! First, we need to measure your feet. Pop your foot in the measurer, please. <laughs> Miss Rabbit is measuring George's feet to help him find shoes that are the right size. Your feet are very small. That's because George is a baby. <laughs> no. George is not a baby. Follow me. <laughs> oh. We keep all our very small shoes over here. Which shoes do you ah. like? George? Shoes! Those are bowling shoes. George <laughs> loves to go bowling. And he oh. loves bowling <laughs> shoes. Are you sure you want those shoes, George? <laughs> shoes! Shoes! Those are tap dancing <laughs> shoes. <laughs> They're very noisy! George loves to make lots of noise. Maybe too noisy. <laughs> shoes! They are clown shoes. Uh -huh. George oh. loves clown Whoa. shoes. Whoa. <laughs> They're too big. And George is very small. Uh, uh, shoes! Shoes! <laughs> George tries on lots of shoes. Tall ones. Little ones. And even silly ones. But none of them are quite right. Shoes! Dinosaur! They are slippers, George. They are not shoes. <laughs> shoes! These are just like your old <gasps> shoes. Shoes! George would like ah. new shoes ah. that are just <laughs> like his old <laughs> shoes. Jolly good. We'll take them, please, Miss Rabbit. Miss Rabbit? Phew! I'm under here! Oh. Shoes! <laughs> George loves his new shoes and he loves the shoe shop. Everyone loves the shoe shop. Today, Peppa and her family are making special <laughs> Halloween treats. These monster eyes are tasty. Why don't you two decorate these cupcakes while I finish making dinner? Hooray! <laughs> Splendid! Here you are. Daddy Pig <gasps> is making the icing for Peppa and George to decorate the cupcakes. The colours are changing. Magic! <laughs> Halloween magic! <laughs> it's not magic, I'm afraid. Just some fruit colouring. Oh, will it still taste good? Fruit colouring only changes the colour. Everything else is still... <gasps> Delicious. Mm. Delicious. <laughs> Peppa is making a spooky pumpkin cupcake while George makes a green dinosaur. Hello, George. I'm a spooky pumpkin cake. <laughs> Peppa and George have finished decorating all the cupcakes. Mm. Now, we're almost ready to eat. I just need to get Mummy Pig from the garden. Mmm, I love spaghetti and garlic bread. Hmm, 
all the extra fruit colouring <gasps> has given Pepper an idea. Should we do a special Halloween trick on Mummy and Daddy? <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and George are using the fruit colouring to make green spaghetti and purple garlic bread. <laughs> Goodness, what happened to dinner? <gasps> ah, you've added fruit colouring. <laughs> Daddy Pig has his own idea for a Halloween trick and treat. <laughs> Spaghetti is green, <gasps> and the bread is purple. Ho, 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 ho. Yes, it's a Halloween trick. But it's just fruit colouring, so the food is still all yummy. Yummy tweet! <laughs> <laughs> a Halloween trick. Brilliant. You really got me. <gasps> and you used fruit colouring to turn my water orange too. <laughs> No, Mummy. That's just orange juice. Oh. <laughs> Peppa loves Halloween tricks almost as much as she loves Halloween treats. <laughs> George! Tonight, George is having a sleepover with Edmund Elephant and Richard Rabbit. All right, everyone. Time for bed. Don't worry, Mummy. I'll make sure they all go to sleep. Thank you, Peppa. <laughs> Come on, then. Into your sleeping bags. Quick march. <laughs> Peppa likes being in charge. Well done, Peppa. Good night, everyone. Good night. <laughs> Only joking. <gasps> you can't go to sleep yet. There's lots of fun things you have to do first. George has never had a sleepover before. He is very excited. First, we have to have a midnight feast. Ah! Ooh. Oh, you've turned into ghosts. <laughs> I know a spooky story about ghosts. George, Richard and Edmund love stories. This is a ghost story about a muddy puddle that wasn't muddy. Ahem! Paranormal apparitions, or ghosts as they're commonly known, do not exist. It is scientifically impossible. Edmund is a clever clogs. He doesn't believe in ghosts. Can I tell a story? Um, OK. <coughs> Ahem! Once upon a time, there was a giant pig and a, a very small rabbit. Squeak, squeak, squeak! And they chased each other forever and ever. <laughs> the end. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good story. Oh, I've got another one. This one is about... George, Edmund and Richard have turned into ghosts again. <laughs> Silly George. Oh, do you know what's next? Yay! We have to stay up very late until, um, 100 o'clock. Ready? Oh. I don't think George understands sleepovers. <laughs> How's everything going, Peppa? They're fast asleep, Mummy. Well done. I think you've earned a midnight feast. Hooray! George and his friends like playing sleepover games, but they love to sleep. Today, Peppa and her class are going on a school trip. Hello, everyone. Who's ready for a school trip? in my lovely new yellow bus. Oh. oh! What happened to your old blue bus, Miss Rabbit? It broke down at the weekend whilst I was taking a nice relaxing drive. Oh dear! Miss Rabbit's bus is unable to race. So it's in the garage for some small repairs. That bus is going to need some big repairs. 
<laughs> Peppa and her friends have never been on a big yellow bus before. Seatbelt check. Check. Then off we go. <laughs> Whoops. Let's try again. Miss Rabbit isn't used to driving the yellow bus. The yellow bus is a bit fast for Madame Gazelle. Miss Rabbit, can the yellow bus play music? The yellow bus can do lots of things. It can do this, this, oh. this, oh. and of course, this. The yellow bus can play music very loudly. Could we turn the music down a little bit? Of course, Madame Gazelle. Aww. Why don't we sing a song instead? The yellow bus wheels go round and round. Round and round, round and round. round, and round. The yellow bus wheels go round, round and round all day long. Play I Spy. Good idea. I spy with my little eye something beginning with R. Road. Nope. <coughs> Rabbit. Nope. It's a really big lorry. Oh. Hello, Mr. Ball. Hello. Peppa's playgroup have arrived for their school trip, so it's time to get off the bus. Oh, I wish we could stay on the yellow bus all day. Don't worry, I'll be back in the bus to take you all home later. Everyone likes riding in the big yellow bus, everyone except Madame Gazelle. Today, Peppa and George are going for a picnic with <laughs> Granny and Grandpa Pig. <laughs> <laughs> it's Peppa's first time being in charge of packing the picnic. Are you okay, Peppa? I need to bring all my toys for the picnic, but they won't fit. Hmm, do you need all of your toys? Uh, I know. I can just bring Teddy instead. Dinosaur! <laughs> and dinosaur. Wonderful. We won't have space for the food if we bring all your toys. What kind of food would you like to make for the picnic, Peppa? Oh, let's make spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Spaghetti is not very good picnic food. How about sandwiches? I love sandwiches too. <laughs> what is your favourite kind of sandwich? Jam! <laughs> Peppa, George and Granny Pig are making Yay! jam sandwiches. Will we need anything else for the picnic, Peppa? Um, we need a comfy picnic blanket. Can you find one, Grandpa? Aye, aye, Peppa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Making jam sandwiches is very messy. And cleaning the mess has made an even bigger mess. Not to worry. You can't make jam sandwiches without getting a little jammy. <laughs> Pepper's sandwiches are triangles. Ta-da! And George's are dinosaurs. <laughs> Got the blanket. Need anything else, Peppa? Hmm. We need cups for our orange juice. Well done, Peppa. Looks like we're ready to go. This is going to be so oh. much fun. Oh no, it's raining. Picnics are not as fun in the rain. Oh dear, I think our outdoor picnic will have to wait, oh. Peppa. Oh. 
But why don't we have an indoor picnic instead? Yay! Peppa has set up her picnic indoors. Now we can have a picnic even when it's raining. And all my toys can come too. Picnic! <laughs> Everyone loves Peppa's picnic and Peppa loved packing it for them. Today, Peppa and her friends are at a go-kart track. Hello, everybody. Who's ready to race go-karts? Me! 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 I am! Peppa and her friends put on their race suits. Red is my favourite colour. Ooh! And don't forget your safety helmets. Now, let's pick your go-karts. Yay! <laughs> Danny Dog has put his helmet on backwards. <laughs> now, the pedals make the go-kart go. And the brakes make it stop. And the steering wheel helps the go-kart turn. Whee! It's just like riding a bike. Why don't you all give it a try and start pedalling slowly? I drive a big car all the time. A go-kart should be easy. Whoa! Whoa! Oh dear, I think I went a little bit too fast. Now, how do I turn around? <laughs> the go-kart race has begun. <laughs> this is fun! But Susie Sheep is pedalling backwards. Try pedalling forward, Susie! Forward? Oh! <laughs> Woohoo! Danny Dog is pedalling very quickly. <gasps> Remember to use the brake, Danny! Mummy Pig is having trouble making her go-kart go. Let's see. This makes it go backwards. Do you need help, Mummy Pig? Oh, no thank you, Miss Rabbit. I'm sure I can do it. My go-kart is too wiggly. Peppa is driving all over the racetrack. Turn the steering wheel more gently, Peppa. Oh, much better. Peppa and her friends like driving around the racetrack in their go-karts. There we go! Whee! And Mummy Pig has finally got her go-kart moving. <laughs> Time's up! Well done, everybody! Hooray! But the go-kart race has finished. Oh. Peppa and her friends love racing go-karts. <laughs> Peppa and Susie are pretending to be police officers. Police, we'll help you. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, police officers. You're welcome. Now we must get back to solving crimes. Nino, Nino. Oh my. What is it, Madam Gazelle? I think my special pen has gone missing. <gasps> this sounds like a mystery. Ah. Don't worry. Me and police officer Susie will solve the case. <laughs> Peppa and Susie are looking for clues to Aha. find the special <laughs> pen. They're using a magnifying glass to make small things look bigger. Aha! Purple. That's the oh. same colour oh. as Danny oh. Dog's T-shirt. <gasps> Have you oh. seen the special pen, Danny? I don't think so. Well, we'd better take you to the police station to ask you some questions. Pepper and Susie have made a pretend police station so they can ask everyone questions about the missing pen. <laughs> It's made from books and pillows. 
This police station doesn't even have doors. It's a nice place to read, though. Peppa and Susie are asking everybody about the special pen. Ooh. They've brought Candy Cat to the pretend police station. Candy Cat, can you remember what colour the special pen is? Hmm, red? No, green. Actually, pink. No, uh, blue. Aha, uh -huh. you've been very helpful. Let's take a big look around. The special blue pen must be <gasps> hidden somewhere. Peppa and Susie are searching everywhere for the special pen. Ah! Oh, but they can't find it anywhere. <laughs> I can't find it anywhere. Hmm. I have an idea. Now, Madam Gazelle is answering questions at the pretend police station. When did you last see your pen, Madam Gazelle? Well, let's see. I used it this morning. Then I put it behind my ear. Oh, my! Yay! Madam Gazelle's special <laughs> pen has been behind her ear all along. We found it. <laughs> we solved the mystery. <laughs> Hooray! Thank you for helping me, Peppa and Susie. I think you would make very good police <gasps> officers. <laughs> It is morning, and Pepper is having some delicious breakfast. Oh. What's happened to the cereal? <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> April Fools? What's that? Today is April Fools Day. It's a day where people make each other laugh by playing silly jokes. Like I just did with your cereal. I like silly jokes. <laughs> Can we do one on Daddy? That's a great idea. Daddy Pig is reading on the sofa, but Mummy Pig and Pepper have come to play a joke on him. Could you please pass my glasses, Mummy Pig? Of course. <laughs> Pepper and Mummy Pig are playing a joke on Daddy Pig. Thank you. <laughs> That's strange. These glasses have made it even harder to see. April Fools! <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. oh, these are joke glasses. Very funny. But you won't be able to play another joke on me. I am much too clever for that. Peppa <laughs> is playing another joke on Daddy Pig. Oh, no. Huh? I can't open this tube of crisps. Can you help me, Daddy? Of course, Peppa. Whoa! Oh, 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 oh. That gave me a fright. <laughs> April <laughs> Fools! <laughs> you got me again, Pepper. Well done. <laughs> Would you like to help me play an April Fools' Day joke on Mummy Pig, Pepper? <laughs> Pepper and her family have finished mm. dinner and are now eating dessert. <laughs> Aha! Me and Peppa have made a tasty chocolate cake for dessert, haven't we, Peppa? Yes. <laughs> How lovely! It looks delicious. <laughs> <laughs> My fork doesn't seem to work. <laughs> Try with your hands. Peppa and Daddy are playing a joke on Mummy Pig. <gasps> this isn't a cake. This is a sponge with icing on it. April, April Fools! Fools. <laughs> 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 oh, what a clever joke. That reminds me. George brought some biscuits for you, Peppa. <laughs> Yay! Thank you, George. I love biscuits. <laughs> April Fools! Peppa loves April Fools Day. Everyone loves April Fools Day. Today, Peppa and her family have come to London to watch Super Potato, the musical. Goodness, we'd better get walking or we'll miss the start of the show. Oh no, we're going to get all wet. 
Not to worry, we can take the underground train instead. Hooray! The underground train is underground. <laughs> it never rains underground. <laughs> and there is a colourful map that shows where all the trains go. It looks like spaghetti. So, we are here. And we need to get here. We can take the blue train first and then take the red train. Yes, well done, Peppa. Off we go. First, Peppa must have her ticket checked by the ticket barrier. <laughs> Thank you, ticket robot. I'm stuck. Hold tight, Peppa. I'll get you out. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This way, Peppa. Follow the blue line, everyone. Um, I'm stuck too. <laughs> the train is arriving at the platform from a very dark tunnel. The train is very, very busy. Why is everybody rushing? They are in a hurry. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. On we go. Watch your step, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome aboard the blue train. Mind the doors. Hold on, Peppa. The underground train is very bumpy. <laughs> <laughs> on your left, you'll see under the ground. And on your right, you'll see even more under the ground. Change here for the red train. The red train? That's us. Watch your step, George. Hold tight, everyone. <laughs> we're here, we're here. The show starts in a few minutes. We might miss the beginning. Oh, no, you won't. Follow me. I'll get you to Super Potato the Musical on time, or my name isn't... Super Potato! Hooray! <laughs> Big celebrity coming through! Make way for the star, thank you! <laughs> no autographs today! Super Potato is in a hurry, too. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. Peppa and Susie Sheep have decided to wear their clothes backwards today. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Susie! Goodbye, Peppa! Oh! Hmm. Peppa, Susie, why are you wearing your clothes backwards? <laughs> oh. <laughs> and why are you walking backwards? Because today is Backwards Day! You say and do everything backwards! <laughs> no, we don't! <laughs> <laughs> well, have fun! <laughs> we won't! <laughs> Peppa and Susie Sheep are chasing each other around the garden backwards. <laughs> You're it! Try to catch me! <laughs> it's very difficult to play games backwards. Where did you go, Susie? Oof. Coming! <laughs> oh. I know! Let's play backwards in the park! <laughs> <laughs> Mr Bull is very confused to see Peppa and oh. Susie Sheep skipping backwards. Good morning! Why are you going backwards? It's backwards day. We have to do everything backwards. Is it backwards day already? <laughs> I'd better get my backwards drills ready. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoops, sorry. Peppa and Susie Sheep spend backwards day playing in the park. Backward swinging feels the same as forward. But not all the games are as fun backwards. This is backwards. No, this is backwards. 
Let's play backwards frisbee. Catch! <laughs> Who would like an ice cream? Yay! Oops, we mean no! no! Oh! <laughs> I see you're having a fun backwards day. I'm going to eat my ice cream backwards. Oops. <laughs> Upside down isn't quite the same as backwards. It's all very confusing. I think backwards day might be over now. Peppa and Susie <laughs> Sheep enjoyed backwards day, but they're very glad that things aren't back. Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Peppa. <laughs> Mummy Pig is dropping Pepper off at Playgroup, but Mummy Pig is also looking after Baby Alexander. Ooh, my! Mind if I clean up Alexander's smelly nappy before I go, Madam Gazelle? I insist. <laughs> oh, can we help clean him up, please? <laughs> okay. Can you pass me the nappy cream from the changing bag <gasps> and a fresh nappy? <laughs> Everyone likes helping <laughs> Mummy Pig change Baby Alexander's nappy. <laughs> there, fresh as a daisy. Can Baby Alexander play with us? Please! Well, I don't see why not. Hooray! Peppa is showing baby Alexander all her favourite bits of the playgroup. These are the books. <laughs> baby Alexander likes all the books. This is the whole world. And he enjoys spinning the globe. <laughs> and this is Madame Gazelle. Bonjour, little Alexander. Oh! But he likes Madame Gazelle most of all. Uh -huh. <laughs> Perhaps it is time for some painting. <laughs> Everyone is painting pictures of themselves, Ooh. called ah. self-portraits. I'm Peppa Paint. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. I'm Freddy. <laughs> I'm Susie. <laughs> and I'm Gerald. <laughs> <laughs> well done, baby Alexander. It looks like a tasty apple. Baby <gasps> Alexander's painting has reminded <laughs> Pepper that it's time for lunch. It's baby Alexander's mm. lunchtime too. He's eating special food for babies. Here comes the train, Alexander. Choo-choo! <laughs> Is baby Alexander's food nice, Mummy? He thinks so. Oh. oh my! Mind if I clean Alexander up again before we head off? I insist. I'll get the bag. Oh, let's go! Oh. Everyone loves having baby Alexander at playgroup, and baby Alexander loves visiting. Peppa and her family are watching a film at the cinema. Wow! Mummy, I need to go to the toilet. OK, Peppa, we'll go to the one just outside. We're just going to the toilet. The toilet? Good idea. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Oh, dear. The toilet is closed for cleaning. But I really need to go. There's a public toilet just down the road. Follow me, everyone. Dinosaur. Peppa and her family have found a oh. toilet. Here's the toilet, Peppa. Let's join the queue. I'm afraid the queue starts over there. <gasps> but the queue for the toilet is very, very long. Sure, I can wait that long. Hmm. There's a toilet in the supermarket, 
Let's try there. Pepper, Mummy Pig, Daddy Pig and George look everywhere for a toilet. They try the supermarket. Aha! Uh -huh. Ah! Oh! They try the zoo. Ah. Sorry, Pepper. This toilet needs fixing. Oh! They even try a toilet shop. I'm sorry, but these toilets are for display purposes only. There are no toilets anywhere. <laughs> oh dear, now I need the toilet too. So do I. <laughs> <laughs> Look, the cinema toilet is open again. Hooray! Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Finally, Peppa and her family are back to watch the film. <gasps> but now the film has ended. <laughs> Looks like we'll have to watch it from the start. Does anyone need the toilet first? Mm. <laughs> <laughs>